Kerry Hill, and I'm the current head teacher of Ayrsmonsel Primary School, which is based in the city of Leicester. Receiving the award in 2018 made a massive difference to our school, um, but also more importantly, it's, it's one of those national benchmarks where you really get to test out your school against a rigorous set of criteria. So we applied for a mental health and wellbeing training programme that we introduced for our staff in school, but with a particular emphasis on our teachers. Uh, we know from national data that more and more teachers are becoming stressed, uh, more and more teachers are thinking about leaving the profession because of issues such as workload, not getting kind of work-life balance, um, anxiety, and they're real issues that our kind of sector is facing, with or without COVID. Um, so for us, after our first award, it really spurred us on to go, we can be reactive, and putting things that, that will help kind of after something happens. But actually we need to be supporting our staff to be proactive themselves. If our staff can develop their mindsets, their behaviours, so that when something gets difficult or challenging, they can flex or they can shift their thinking or they can act in a different way, then some of that stress and strains and some of those challenges might reduce because of the way that we approach them. Achieving the standard is, is, has multiple meanings. Um, for us as a school, it's recognition of the work that we've done. It's actually given us um, external validation of a very high level that says the quality of our training um, is really up there with the best that's being offered in the country. Um, for us as a staff, and particularly for us as a school leadership team, we know that we're offering those opportunities to our staff to support them, to develop them, not just in the time that they're with us, but actually as they move and grow throughout their careers as well. It's celebrated nationally and you know that you can share it. And, and it coming from the Princess Royal herself and knowing she's actively involved in the process of selecting the programmes, looking at the evidence, looking at the criteria, um, actually knowing that the Princess Royal herself has selected our school to be a recipient is, is just an amazing experience, not just for me, but our children, our families and all of our staff.